Maybe we should leave the spider cave for the next time we come back to the the inn. We do got to get to the Thorn Ford. Tusk. Wow, wow. That layer is way down there. All right. How long is it to here? Eight. It's an eight hour travel time just to get to there. There. We go there back to hand in a quest. And then head out. Screw it. Let's get the quest done. At least we know we have a quest there. Random encounter. Wait. You're off to sleep? All right, man. Thank you so much for stopping by. Hope you're enjoying the playthrough. It did not start off well today. Morning, we had so much you? trouble getting with those bad rolls. But it's definitely going better. A bandit cleric. How do you get behind us? No, oh, in front of us too. All right, this one's me. There's a bandit necromancer. Let's charge. Yeah, I got him. All right. Uh, can't charge because the other people are in the way. Yeah, screw it. Get in range. Oh, she can charge. Nope, she can't. Okay, that's just normal attack. That's fine. Let's get this necromancer gone. Go oh! I don't know what enchantments on that blade, but that people don't normally go when you slice them. I bet they're feeling awfully foolish for attacking us. This is where I step in. Taxes. <laughs> they both had attacks of opportunity and missed. Do not hold us. That's horrific. I kind of love it. Does that inflict wounds? Nope, that's a ray of sickening. Okay. We got another thing of breastplate. Uh, he's already wearing breastplate. Yeah, she can have breastplate though. I didn't realize it'd be better than what she had by that much. Okay. As it should be. That wasn't a bad encounter. One tried to sneak up behind us, the other was waiting like you think they would have had the cleric walk up front and the necromancer cast a spell behind us once they were busy, right? But nope. Continue on our way. Oh, endless plants. A new location discovered. How we didn't see that the first time, I couldn't tell you. Probably distracted by the thought of going into a cave full of spiders. The problem when you have arachnophobia. Spiders freak you out, man. You could dicker about the definition of a deity. I don't know if you, if they're if they're effectively all powerful and some have created species. That's pretty much that's a god. Like sure, I guess there's like the the great lesser and greater gods and stuff, but they're gods. You can't really argue it too hard at that point. That is not far. All right, here we go. Hopefully the spiders haven't respawned. 
But we didn't kill all of them, so I could see them definitely repopulating. Oh, um. I am your shield. Bell. Wait, does that is that all the light it gives? That little bit. Yeah, that's all that does. A tiny little bit of light. Follow my lead. Okay. Um, I forgot to put the torch on. At least we can attack with the torch. There we go. That's a little bit better lighting. Forget it. Come on, you got this. Won't work. Stop crushing them with your hand and just gently pluck them. Forget it. Won't work. Time's not waiting. I can't. Ugh, won't work. That was easy. Easy, she says. It only took what? Ten tries? Twenty tries? All according to plan. Alright. There was that spider swarm and a room full of spiders this way that we got wiped. That was on the harder game settings though. So maybe this time it won't be so bad. Plus, we have a lot more acid and all that. Oh no, it went before we did. I'll survive. I always survive. They've already taken her down. Holy shit. All right, let's see. Five damage, six damage. How did they take her down already? She should have had close to 30 hit points. Got a cure light wound. We have the cure moderate wound scroll. I don't think we do. Nope. We used it up already. Oh, see, this is probably taking her out. Did one damage again. We're doing only one damage each time again. Alchemist fire here. Hey, that one did four. That's better than one. I'll survive. I always survive. Is harem. All 
All right, my turn. Wait, seriously, it won't let me throw a flask after moving? Take your fam and throw it into the wazoo. I wanted to, all I want to do was walk away from the thing before I threw threw the vial on it. Well, I guess I wasted Clutch's turn. Because now you won't be able to do anything. Which makes no sense, because you should be able to move and do something, but okay. Does she have one on her belt still? No. If I put it in her belt, she won't be able to use it, I think. It's actually gonna let me use it. Okay. Acid flask. It did three damage. All right. Still have nine hit points. Oh my. We are foobard. At least it's burning with the alchemist fire. Alchemist fire. It's got a tiny little bit. Just took two more damage from Lindsay's fire. So let's. That's what? Uh, five damage so far this round. So is nine hit points? It's how much hit points it started with? Because I thought we had a four. No, I'm not going over the whole thing. I'll just assume the game's not screwing me over. Lindsay's turn. Almost dead. One damage to it, apparently. I'll survive. I always survive. Is that what? Is she? Yeah, negative seven, or is she dead? Anyways, the, sp the, the swarm's gone now, I think? Nope, it's just over by Clutch. Okay. Uh. It's gone! Finally! Oh, for the love of God, thank you so much! Oh no, two more spiders just joined the fight. There's another swarm. We've been in that room, there was not another swarm. Now it feels like the game's just cheating. It's like, oh, you managed to beat that one? Then here's a good old F you too. Ooh, 
one damage. Huzzah. And somehow it did 30 damage to a character that was uh, like, her getting knocked out instantly has just screwed us over completely. All right, let's see. I'd love to start killing those guys. Uh, shit. There's two spider swarms coming. This didn't work. I must be doing it wrong. This didn't work. I must be doing it wrong. This didn't work. I must be doing it wrong. This didn't work. You can't just throw it. You have to throw it on one of them. Did nine damage. That time it worked. <laughs> Can't really complain when it goes that way. Except for as soon as this thing comes through, it's going to probably permanently kill her. All right, she's at eight hit points. So she was at negative seven. Although we just skipped her turn, I think. Yeah, we just missed her turn, it looks like, where it would have been. So, that sucks. Can we still move? No? Okay. Um. <coughs> oh, right. He's going to back up. He sees those spiders coming. Let's try this way. Shouldn't I have my offhand attack? I, I wish I knew why it doesn't always do my offhand attack. Or can I only do that if I don't move at all? Is there not a button to just say stand up? Because it seems like if I... It's only giving me the option of standing up when it's... Moving her. I don't want to accidentally have her get like multiple attacks of opportunities. Pressing this button during the turn base mode will switch actions available for the currently selected target. Four actions or single tech actions. No. Um, I don't see one for just to say stand up. All right, I guess we'll just Tell her to stand up. It just juiced up an action and she didn't move. She should have been able to stand up and do something, but it blew an action for some reason and didn't stand her up. 
I'm getting so annoyed at bugs. Like, it seems like there's a lot of bugs happening that should be shit that goes one way. That it does it other times, and then sometimes it just doesn't do it. Which is frustrating. I don't mind dying a lot, but I, I like dying a lot because I'm screwing up, not because the game's not being consistent. Alright, let's try throwing. I'm killing all my friends. Oh. Well, that sucked. Alright. Lindsay's turn. Alright, Lindsay usually does pretty good throwing the fire. I think it's because she's got good decks. We're running out of the fire, though. That's kind of scary. All right. We're going to take the alchemist fire and throw it at the spider swarm. I missed. One damage. We've been in that room on another save. There was only one swarm. How's there three this time? And I'm survive. I always survive. No, you're gonna die because the game is being stupid. Harem, you got bad decks. You can throw the acid. I'm not letting you throw the fire. Alchemist fire. My fingers are crossed. <laughs> mm. We're doing a lot of ones. Does that count? Enlarge myself, but I can't throw another flask. I'll survive. Uh, uh, I always survive. <laughs> Doesn't seem like you're doing a good job of surviving right now. Deals one's damage to the spider swarm. Great. Lindsay. I'm out of the good stuff. She dealt one again because. I always survive. Negative 10 now. Yeah, she's going to die. Lick wounds. Uh, ooh, no, no. no, it's immune to inflict wounds even. Wonderful. I'm glad I wasted my turn. Alright, this is not going good, guys. It's at my feet. I can't even drop it straight. I have to freaking throw it somewhere. Like, come on. At this point, it's like, I just had to drop it at my feet. How hard is it to, like, spike a vial? I could do that in my sleep. 
Probably would get it on my own feet, but you know, it's it get the spiders that are on the ground. My only saving grace is our bot his body's blocking them. I've used over 50. Oh my goodness. I brought 20 vials. I'm down to two. And that might not be enough. Oh, sorry. I'm down to three, apparently. It looks like it might actually end up being enough. All right. Uh, can I charge? I hit. Yay. Apparently not using the torch as a weapon anymore. When did her strength get damaged? It's a good thing she doesn't need strength that much, but... Alright. It's up next. Please kill it. There we go. Um... Magic missile. This won't get her back on her feet. Puts her to negative eight. Oh, I should have used the wand of cure medium wounds. I'm an idiot. Uh, this one has some damage. This should do it. Hey, at least I got both my attacks that time. I guess maybe it's only under, only taking a little step. I'm wondering all the times when it didn't do both attacks, why it didn't do both attacks. going on I guess it's not going to try to cure a calculated risk Well, that was a wonderful blowing of a Cure Light Wounds. At least it went off that time. I think it was technically out of her range to walk and cast it. But for some reason, rather than... Like, just walking as close as you can and keeping the spell ready to use, it walked closer and then did nothing and froze until he turned off turn-based mode.
Because it wouldn't even let me like end her turn. It just it was like, nope, not working. Do not falter. She's at zero. There, she's at eleven now. This will hurt. No, it won't. You have to hit something to hurt it. Okay. Stand up. Wonderful. At least it's letting me attack. She got a revenge at long freaking last. Oh my goodness. Yes. Use I'm your last here. heal. Didn't do much for her. Figures. Adventures call to them. Your light yes. wound. Yes. Your light wound. Yes. Yes. All right. Not the spiders. Serves you right. Not the freaking spider. Okay, so these are a bunch of dead spiders from this guy. Orc double axe, a moderate cure wounds, coal, and a masterwork dagger. That's all that that got us. Let's get out of this hellhole. I never want to come back to it again. This place has been horrible. Literally the worst. I just wasted $400 in potions trying to kill stupid three stupid swarms. In due time. Our people are the worst at throwing vials in the history of throwing vials. All this for a stupid quest. I believe it's eight hours away. If we get there and the berries are bad, I'm killing the guy that asked us to do the quest. Just to warn everybody. I know we're playing a good playthrough, but... At this point, it seems like the quest is not worth it. Like, when he sent us on the quest, he gave us six vials of that alchemist stuff. Not nearly enough. Alright, 150 experience and two cure light wounds. So I spent $400 to get 150 experience and $100 in potions. So I smell spreads on Bogan's face and glint in his eyes. Sorry, my friend, but after you took a while through, through the cave, there's nearly a spider left. So now it's safe enough for me to gather the berries myself rather than pay someone else. Anytime I need to cook dinner or make a potion, that bucket of moon radishes will be plenty for me. <laughs> for me to uh, help Oleg for a time to come, I mean. Truth be told, as I've gotten older, I've gotten kind of particular and my appetite is almost gone. Everything I eat is particularly, practically tasteless to me. I can barely force myself to swallow a bite. Only thing I can still taste is fangberries. So I add them to my porridge or to my to roasted meat. I even add them to my potions. When I ran out of fangberries, I stopped eating entirely. Vetlana tried to help me, the deer. She baked pies for me, cooked me fish soup and stewed venison, but I just couldn't eat any of it. I was desperate. Those damn spiders had sucked the last bit of joy out of my life. If not for you, I'd pretty much have starved to death. Miserable to the end. Just because you wouldn't have liked it doesn't mean you couldn't have eaten it just to make sure you don't die. Woken blushes heavily and coughs in his fist. That's uh, for Oleg. 
He sprained his back last summer. You see, he tried to move a heavy chest all by himself. You can't even imagine the healing powers of those radishes. They make a great pain-killing ointment. Potent, exquisite, I just, um... I feel like he's lying. Oleg would never confess his weakness to anybody, but I see him wince every time he bends over to pick something up. The old man sighs a bit too loudly. Oh, when will the poor man realize he's not 15 anymore? All right, show me your, what you have. Fangberry for Boken, complete. Okay, light crossbow, light crossbow. Your masterwork dagger and long sword. A plus one orc double axe. This is what, a D4 plus... Oh, it's just Masterwork, so it's plus one to hit, not to damage. Um, 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 um. Get rid of the dagger. And the chain mail. Rope. Okay. Scorched fragment of a necklace. If you find enough fragments, it could be restored. How do you know how many pieces it needs? It seems you have found a shard of a destroyed artifact. You'd find all the fragments, and artisan with enough skill could restore it. We have two pieces. Could that be the whole thing? All right, 203, eh? Are we getting a discount now or something? Because these potions of cure light wounds used to cost 50. And it was 300 for the moderate. Not that I'm complaining. I like the, the fact that alchemical fire is only 15 instead of 20. Still going to cost me 50, get me 53. Okay. Uh, we're good for potions still. All right. Is there a benefit to resting here rather than resting on the road? As it should be. This is supposed to be a safe space, right? Saving. Okay. Let's hit the road and maybe this time not get decimated by swarms. Our little raccoon guy. Good old Ember. All right, we're not going to be. Is that short sword? There we go. We don't need the torch until you know it's dark. That is not far. Is it going to do this every time when I leave that here? Okay, we're at full hit points, no status ailments. Hopefully the swarm doesn't just walk right over Amiri and have her die again. <laughs> or, well, fall unconscious. 